Welcome back to some more in Shroud. Right, you know, I'm just gonna continue to make some more content out of comments. Because some said that I might have missed some lore in Pikeman's Reach, which could be very possible. But again, we will see. Well, let's have a look, see. Where could that have been? It was supposed to be Imperial Gardens. So that is over here? Yeah, it was this place that I stood at. And a glow, I believe that is that one. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna just have a quick look around here and just to be safe. What is it? Oh, right, uh, there's an entire catacomb down there. Hmm, yeah, the light was probably this lantern. Maybe, maybe, maybe. And according to another comment, again from Terrace Crutchfield, there's supposed to be 129 law pages. It said something about Sister Sister being at Surest to Rest. Okay, let's uh, go and have a look over there. I mean, the fastest way is probably this thing. Right, the Sister Sister lore is... is from Sir Strest's to uh, Raven Keep, I believe. At least there's where we get the Lupus Scythe. Yeah, but I do believe that I found that. Then again, well, might as well have a look. We've discovered something at Sir Strest. It was also the Dragon lore. Okay, let's see if we've missed it. Chances are that we have, because Sir Strest is... Quite big. I do wonder if I have enough stamina for this. Eh. If we fall, we fall. Now, where could stuff be? Edgy right over me, huh? Now, it would probably be easier to find stuff during the night. Oh, you bastard. Stand still, please. Where are you going? Isn't there? Oh, hang on. Ah, the bastard. Come on. And come on. Huh? Not sure how much damage I do. I did switch up to the wolf snarl bow, so it should do more damage. Ah, again, these people are resistant to fire. Hmm, yeah, that's an issue. Let's see, I have been down here, haven't I? Yeah, nothing hidden here, nothing hidden over here. Alicabe, sure thing. Okay, let's have a look around then. Hang on, explosions, and a little bit of fighting, and a little bit of blocking. Nice. Hmm, yeah, I don't see a neighbor around here. That it should be at the back of the arena. Now, the arena is at the very back against Mjar. Okay, let's let's have a look. Should probably be a little bit careful about the boss. Building at the back of the arena. Building at the back of the arena, you say. Oh, there's the boss. Building and oh, okay. Well, there we go. Not sure how he hit me. Building at the back of the arena. This is the arena. I hope he doesn't mean what's down in the shroud, because then I would be screwed. And, okay. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, Oh, I forgot about the explosions. Oh, God. Okay, what do we have now? All oh, right. Okay, I remember. Uh, building at the back of the arena. What does he mean by back at the arena? I mean, there's a building underneath here. You're a stressed building at the back of the arena. Hmm. I don't see any more here. Oh, hang on. Wow. Oh. <laughs> right. Well, there you go. Sister, sister. Ah, there we go. Okay, okay. Neat, neato. A note to Kendall. Sister, have my notes gotten through to you? I've missed you greatly this past year. The wild contractor tried to lock me up in a cellar in Jasper's Isles. Okay, but you were correct. He couldn't keep me shackled for long. I'm sorry. I've been out of touch, but I've been keeping my head down. Umber Hollow isn't any better or worse than Sarah's Rest. Two sides of the same coin, like us. More power fights, perhaps, but... I can handle them. The Nomad Highlands are without order. One day we must eclipse this chaos. Sister, what do you say? Your sister Lupa. Okay. Well, then we found that too. 120. Oh, hang on. Yeah, okay. So he has 129 lore. Okay, so I miss a few, you say. Look at the flame around the starter base. Que pasa? A letter to a former friend. Flames around the starter base. Okay. Well. Oh. We're just gonna follow the comment blindly. The flames at the starter base. Is he referring to this one? At the flames? Huh? Or? I mean, this is my starter base. Look at the flames. Uh, Kabasa. There's not much flames around here. A couple of birds. Yeah, letter to a former friend. Yeah, I found that. Okay. Hmm. Well, it does seem like we are missing something. What is this? Why do I have a line here? Oh, right, this is the place where I put all of the building materials. 
in order to see the difference of them. Okay. Well, let's um, just double check the lore down meow, to see if it's still bugged. Ah, it is. Okie dokie. Well, thanks again, Teresa Crutchfield, for the invaluable information. You know, I have been at Sarah's Rest quite a lot. But you know, you know, you know, always discover something. There's always something hidden. Oh, God. Well, I do also have the quest to find more rare weapons. Maybe I will continue to do that a little bit. I said that I was going to do it off camera. Uh, but again, I don't have that much time. So what more could I actually miss? Hmm. Like, there's a possibility that there's something in the Springlands close to where I'm at now. Possibly. But I also have a tendency to rush through content. Then again, I have explored quite a bit. I mean, everything is open over here. You know? Yeah. Huh? Oh, the little bastard. Where was he? Okay. Huh. And also think that I need to switch up the bow. Yeah, because I do prefer um, being able to fire faster. I don't necessarily need all that damage. Yeah, probably. Yeah, this is the carpenter place. Hmm. Yeah, I do believe that we have gone too far already. Okay, let's uh, switch up the bow at least. Uh, what kind of arrow am I using? I am using the wooden arrows. If I change to those... Let's see. Ow. Right. Well, we are going to... Uh, maybe this place. What? Oh, I'm in the shroud. Okay. Well, let's get out of the shroud then. And let's test our powers against a bird. Are there any birds here? I know there's a bird here. Okay. Where's the bird? The bird should be right over there. Right. And a shush. And a shush. Come on. At least hit. Huh? Quite a big bit of damage. Yep. Okay, so it does decent damage. That does. Anything over here? Well, that's the bow that I'm gonna use, so, yeah. Hmm, I do wonder. I mean, we might as well give it a little bit more of a go. See if there's anything at all that we can get from this place. It would be fun to see some legendary stuff, but since I haven't gotten them in all of my many, many hours, I, I'm kind of doubtful that it actually exists. Ah, another spiked bow, eh? Now, I do believe that I've only seen this in common. Fire magic damage, eh? Mm, shots from this spike bow can pierce anything. Uh, sure it can, uh, and it looks good. And again, I kind of prefer the look of regular bows, and this bow does look neat, but it should be faster. This one is also slow, but yeah, high damage, and it looks awesome. Mm. Oh, and one thing that I'm going to test out, I did get a comment right before I went on vacation that they might have changed the Felwyvern. Now, I haven't defeated the Felwyvern in quite some time, so maybe I'll have a look there and see if anything's new, because apparently it has a super jump. Now, it does jump, but hmm. we will see. I guess I'll test that today too, but first off, a little bit of looting. Okay, so that's about 10 minutes of looting, now we... I have gotten uh, quite a bit of bombs. Not too many fancy weapons and loads of legendary armor. Mm, yeah, but nothing that I haven't really seen before. Done that, I've seen this before. Oh, that's a fancy looking hammer. Yeah, well, over a stack, I do believe I had a stack and a half of regular bombs. So over a stack of the explosive powder bowl. 12 of those. Ah, er, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, calm down, you. Taste my arrows. Oh, okay, that was that was quite a close one. Oh boy. <sighs> yeah, well, <sighs> twelve ones of the green ones and seventeen of the rare ones, eh? Hmm. Yeah, it's a good way to get some stuff. A little bit of spells too that I don't really use anymore. Almost a thousand runes. Ten minutes. Hmm, not bad. Okay, but I want to test out what's his face. Felwyvern, big blue doggo. Now, I don't think that I well, might as well repair, even though I haven't done anything. Ah, one thing. Fire Wisp Summon Scrolls. Maybe. Maybe, just maybe. Because I wanted to test that out quite some time ago, but it didn't really work out since the Felwyvern, well, killed them all, and also I summoned them above, <sighs> above the boss, so they got stuck. Okay, but this time if I just roll in, I might as well show my HUD. Okay, let's give it a go. Big blue doggo. I don't remember anything in the patch notes, then again, I do skim through them. Okay, here's the big blue doggo. And let's start off with some stuff. I'm gonna spread them apart a little bit, so that they don't hold this time. Oh, hang on, I need mana. Right. Hmm. Yeah, it destroys the pillars. Ow. 
Okay, a little bit of mana potion. Actually, a few mana potions. Alright, yeah, I don't have that stuff anymore. Ow, okay. Mana potion, mana potion. Okay, I need to be a little bit careful. Okay, they haven't done really any damage yet, but they are out and about doing something. Okay, they're fine, they're level 25. Yeah, but they still only do 10 damage. And that's all of them dead. <laughs> oh god. Hang on, if I shoot him in the face. There we go. Then we hurt him. Yeah, that's definitely a technique and a half. Let's see, nothing new with the commander ring. Oh, they changed the texture of the key. Okay, sure. What? What are you firing at? Oh, right, there's a bug. Schmack. Hmm. I mean, they're, they're, they're doing something. Not much, but they uh, work great as a distraction. Uh, well, I did use up all my, almost all of my mana potions. Hmm, okay, but I think that we need to do uh, another go. And we're also gonna change up the bow, because I do enjoy being able to fire faster. I mean, we don't need a key, but we don't. Okay, let's do another go. Let's see if we can get the bastard to jump. Ah, uh, the flying is so peaceful in this game. But yeah, they need to add something. Kinda wish to do a loop-de-loop. -loop. Okay, where are you at? Come at me, bro. Now, let's see. What happens if I actually try to fly up? Okay, let's experiment a little. If we go over here, will he do anything up here? Oh! He actually hit me. Interesting. Can I kite him out? No, uh, seems like he just does his thing. And he summons up the little bugs, but they can't fly, can they? Oh, hang on. Okay. Oh, right. Those get destroyed. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I get it, I get it. Ow. Come on. Oh, I missed. Okay, if we do like so, I mean, might as well hit him a little bit, so maybe we can heal up. No, we don't want to kill him yet. Let's see, can I go up here? Okay, if I jump in here, fly up here, why can't I fly? Okay, that's a gem. Okay, if I stand up here, he's gonna use his trick. Oh, hang on, that hurts. He's gonna summon stuff again. But is he gonna disappear? Yeah, he does disappear. Then he re-enters. Okay, so I don't think that I can test out his super gem. Ow, come on, do the roar. There we go. And then a quick shot. And then he is a dead man. Not bad. Yeah, okay, so nothing special that drops from him, eh? Oh, it will be fun to uh, kill the bosses in Valheim again. I mean, I'm not gonna diss in Shrouded any or anything. I mean, I did get destroyed the first time I attempted this boss. But again, I didn't really have much armor or good weapons. But yeah, the bosses in Valheim are definitely harder. Oh yeah, it's this area, right. And I will play Valheim as soon as the full release is out. At least the full Ashland re release. Now, I could play the PTB player test, uh, public player test stuff, but uh, if there's any kinks, I kind of want them to work them out first. Okay, now hang on. There's another boss. Might as well. Ow. Okay. That's a lot of damage. Yeah. Hmm. Wizard chest. I mean, let's see. I do enjoy the coat that I have already. How does this look? Um, uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, this looks better. It does. Oh, explosions. Can't forget about explosions. Now the issue is... Uh, I'm still missing lore. What, where? Okay, so now I found the sister sister, thanks to Sarah. What do we miss? We still miss Pillars of Creation. Two in the Pillars of Creation, don't we? No, one of them was probably the sister sister one. Yeah. Now, I do remember someone saying something about the goblet. Now, was that in East Lapis? Ah, uh, possibly. Something about the goblet. It's the oasis. Hmm, there's not really that many more big cities around. Uh, I do remember a goblet, but I can't remember exactly where. And I can't find a comment, uh, comment no more. Hmm. Well, alrighty, alrighty. And if there is 129 lore, then again, it could be more. Uh, nah, there's probably someone out there who has collected all of it and you could do, you know, data mining in the game, but yeah, since I don't really do much research, it's almost like playing in the good old days where you had no idea where thing was. You had to ask your friends. Now, this was the time before YouTube and basically before the internet. No, there was loads of, you know, uh, forums, but not that many dedicated to games. Now, I do still remember Rune Helper with Rune Escape, but I played a lot of <laughs> Rune Escape without any help at all, and boy was I proud of myself um, being able to do the puzzles and all the quests without any assistance. I mean, it missed me like a smart cupcake. But again, I think that people have become very reliant on hand-holding when it comes to quests. 
in games. I mean, I'm not sure if I would have enjoyed this game as much if they didn't, you know, put me on a path, but it's it's hard to say. I do enjoy a little bit of hand-holding. Sometimes it's just good game design to show where you're supposed to go. Still have the option to go anywhere, like most of the... Uh, Dark Souls games, where you could just go anywhere, but you would most likely die, unless you were good at the game, <laughs> which I'm never, uh, I'm never good at the game at the start. Oh, it's gonna be interesting to see the Elden Ring DLC, if I'm even able to beat it. Well, I probably will, but it's gonna take some time. We'll see. Okay, now what is this? Where are we now? Yeah, we're at most pleasure. Hmm. Okay, we're kind of just roaming about. Hmm. Now, could there be any secrets here? No, I know there's a chest here with the building blocks, the timbered half blocks, I think, wasn't it here? It was supposed to be in an open place. Hang on, it was supposed to be near pigs. Now, maybe that's not here. Maybe that's at a thornhold. Hmm. Yeah, a little bit of chamomilla. Okay, I need to make a mental note. Chamomilla you can just get here. Well, at least two. It is faster to just log in and out in order, uh, rather than, you know, farming it yourself. Ah, uh, not necessarily, because farming it yourself is passive. Hum, 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 hum. Ah, oh, my wife's adorable. Maybe she's doing some sewing. We bought some clothes in uh, during the vacation. They were too cheap, and there is probably a reason for that. They were full of holes. Yeah, but a little bit of needle and thread action, and they were as good as new. Even though the needle and thread probably cost more than the shirts and pants that we bought. Right, okay, but I don't really have any more goals right now, so I think that we're gonna end it here. But as we usually do, we're probably just gonna head straight back home. And is tradition, I'm gonna go here, look at the camera with my character, I'm gonna look at you, I'm gonna say, as always, until next time.